Alright guys, what's going on? Scarlet Spider here. Today, I'm bringing a very different video and I'm very frustrated right now. <laughs> so essentially, the premise of this video is that I had 130,000 credits on this game. Essentially, when I quit, I never spent them because I was waiting on like those specific character packs. And since I wasn't playing at the time that they were dropping them, I never spent them. So I was just waiting for the next character pack to come out and then it never really did I had all these credits stacked up from essentially like the past two years as well so I had a hundred thirty thousand which is about 65 packs um so I opened up 65 elite packs and I recorded my reactions and everything and no audio <laughs> I don't know why I got no audio so we're gonna do this video a little different now because I don't want to waste the footage of literally opening 65 packs I wanted to do like one of the biggest pack opening videos videos I mean it's 65 packs is essentially like an over $300 value and I just wanted to see what I would get right now I'm just kind of showing off like the legendaries and the elites in each packs but they were pretty cool I got a lot of cool stuff a lot of duplicates and everything and essentially I got a couple really cool characters like I know I got V-Day Anya and, I, and I've always wanted her I know I got like the ninja shepherd and that one was really cool so essentially I opened up all these packs and I got a lot of stuff and I ended up just scrapping a lot of the stuff just scrapping all my duplicates to see how much scrap I could get I think I got like around 10,000 by the end of everything I know I got like four different like foam uh, Lancers which are legendary so it gave me like 1800 scrap so at the end here uh, I started crafting different characters that I wanted I crafted Scourge and Mira for Locust for sure and then I also crafted the Spectre Shepherd which is the white one because that was an elite and I never got on that one and then I also crafted the Lambin elite grenadier I missed out on the Lambin one as well so that was just an elite so I crafted that as well I crafted classic Dom which was a character I've always wanted so I was very hyped to get that as well and then I also crafted the UIR elite which is like the blue UIR which was something else that I I really wanted but I never got the chance to get I missed out on a lot of these packs when they dropped so so it was fun opening up all these elite packs. I'm very frustrated that my audio didn't record. So we're, we're doing this video a little bit differently right now. Like at least you guys can see like each pack. A lot of the commons are, you know, a lot of duplicates and, and you know, you can see stuff that I didn't have, but man, I got like so many of like the smile camos and the sugar camos and stuff like that. Essentially with, with gears five coming out now, I, I was just like, man, I have all these credits. Might as well just spend them before gears five comes out. It's not like I'm going to be on this game <laughs> very much once Gears 5 comes out, obviously. It would have been nice to have a reaction, but I mean, it would have been a very long video as well. I mean, I, I guess this isn't the worst way to do it. So I just figured that I just kind of do this little commentary over all the packs since my audio got fucked. So essentially, we're like a week out from Gears 5. I'm going to be dropping like a lot of money on this game. Like, I'm going to get the Collector's Edition. I'm going to get that 112 scale Kate Diaz figure that you get the camos for. Or I'll probably get the controller so I'm just getting anything that like you know you get codes with so that I can kind of like show off the character in the game and I know they have that like a collaboration as well coming out so that'll be fun too and I'll, and I'll get that for sure as well but yeah I figure since I'm gonna be dropping all this money when the game comes out in a week anyways I might as well drop all my money that's actually in the game <laughs> uh, the elite packs were actually pretty good like I honestly didn't know if it, I would start getting a lot of duplicates but yeah man it really sucks that my audio didn't record I think the reason for it was because I just got this new webcam. It's a Razer Keo, so I hope that my face cam looks better in these videos as well. Because with this one, there's actually a ring light. It lights up my face a lot better, which is already a plus. But this one can also record 60 FPS, which is really nice, which is why I bought it. Because I always wanted my webcam to be 60 FPS to match my gameplay. But it only does it at 720p, but when you shrink it down into a face cam, you can barely like tell the quality difference between the 1080 anyways. But everything's 60 FPS now. So that looks really cool. I figured right before Gears 5 would be the best time to invest. But yeah, so I had to like do a new way of recording and everything else. And literally, you know, the audio is working right now. I don't understand why it didn't work in the actual video because my mic was going off and everything. So that's really frustrating, but it shouldn't happen again. It's just a brand new webcam. It just sucks that this is kind of like a one and done video. Like I can't reopen up 65 packs. <laughs> but yeah, and then I also crafted the, uh, the high roller emblem, which was one of the 
gilded uh, challenges for Gears 5 as well. So I was hyped that I could get that as well. The only challenges that I have left, the horde ones. So I don't have gilded JD or the emblem with that as well for playing a few public horde games. So I figure I might as well make a horde video. I never have. So I'll be doing that in the future as well. Just playing a few public games of horde and see how it goes because I, I literally haven't on this game at all. So I'm hyped to do that. I mean, that's something else that's going to be different on my channel coming here. I've been trying to keep on the daily upload grind. I've been uploading a lot of highlights and obviously my channel kind of died down a bit after I, you know, took such a long break, but it's, it's cool to see the consistent views. And, and then once Gears 5 drops, I mean, we'll be making new videos every day, just like new kind of different cut comms every day. Cause it's not like I'm going to have a highlights video the first day the game comes out. So we're just going to be trying a bunch of new and different stuff every day. I also uploaded my Gears Pop video. I hope you guys check that out as well. I, I, tr I put a lot of effort into that video. I'm just getting my first impressions. I did a massive pack opening with that too because I had all the pops and then I also did like my kind of like first like vlog segment where I actually showed off my pops. So if you guys didn't check out that video, I would definitely encourage you to because it was definitely a cool video in my opinion that I tried like a lot of new stuff in and I tried to make pretty different than anything other on my channel and also, you know, recording a phone game was completely different as well. But yeah, I mean, we got cool stuff out of these packs, but I just thought it'd be a really cool idea since, you know, I don't know if there is a bigger pack opening than like, you know, 65. It's, it's like a $325 value, um, 130,000 credits. I missed out on like the classic pack. So I didn't get classic Dom, which, you know, I always wanted classic Dom. I always played as Anya in like Gears 3 and Judgment and everything too. I remember I had to buy Anya like a weird way when I got Judgment as well. It was like a pre-order bonus and or something. And I just, I think I bought the code like off of eBay or I can't even remember. But yeah, I mean, the main focus at this point is just, I guess, these like gilded characters. I didn't get gilded ROM, which kind of sucks, but I'm not even close to re-up 10. I think I'm like eight or I'm close to eight right now. But yeah, the only other thing I can remember like buying for this game was I got this um Gears of War Rise of ROM comic book. You got one of these, uh, the Rise of ROM mega packs. So you had the chance for either like Uzel Srock or Void ROM. I got Uzel Srock. But yeah, I mean, it's cool. I love comic books. So I was, I was very hyped to have like a Gears of War comic book. Like that's just sweet. But yeah, I mean, I, I hope you guys still like enjoy like seeing what I got out of these packs and like seeing what I crafted and everything. But yeah, I've been trying to like stay on the daily upload grind. I hope you guys have been like enjoying like the highlight videos and everything that I've been putting out just with all my leftover clips and everything. I actually have like so many that they'll probably like go into Gears 5 as well. But yeah, guys, so my audio actually continued to tweet. I've never seen it. It literally like sounded like a goddamn robot. Like it was like coming in and out and it was mad weird. But I got my baby Scarlet chilling in my lap. <laughs> yeah, so I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all the characters and everything. I have a couple mini tages that I could upload here too that I made when I was in the vile as well. So I've just been waiting to drop those. But if I see a lot of support on this video and you guys want to see it, I'll be sure to drop it really soon along with the rest of my highlights. But yeah, we're really close to Gears 5, guys. I'm really stoked for it. Can't wait. I hope you guys have been enjoying the uh, uploads for me and uh, we're just going to continue to stay grinding. Looking forward to the future. We got like a week road to Gears 5. Um, it's, it's lit. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and the calm. I'm sorry it didn't go as planned, but I mean, I hope it still was enjoyable. But yeah, we will see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Come